Hey guys, and welcome to Cryplay's Folklore. This is a game made by Game Republic, which I know very little about. In fact, I know so little about it, you can't even buy it digitally. I had to buy a physical copy off of eBay, which is something I very rarely do. So I'm gonna hope it was worth it. So let's give it a shot. I lost my mother when I was very young. My only memory of her is telling me bedtime fairy tales about a mysterious village. The village of Dulu, where the living could meet the dead. And now she tells me she's alive. Mother, why did you wait so long? I told you! This is as far as I go! Please, just get us a little closer to the shore. Not a chance in hell! We'd never make it back! I have a family to look after, miss, so leave me out of this! I've decided! We're turning back! Wait! I must see my mother! It's for your own good! Thank you. I appreciate it. I'll get there on my own. Miss, you'll be killed! No! A dark cloud cast over my life with my mother's death and the ensuing solitude. I will not rest until I find her. Even in modern times, many phenomena go unexplained. Spiritual encounters are constantly reported in all corners of the globe. At the same time, the march of modern science makes a steady advance. It may not be long before the boundaries between life and death, indeed, the destinies of men, will be dissected and explained to us by modern science. You may find it strange for me, a reporter for an occult magazine, to say this. Oh, damn it. Another prank call. Editorial department, Unknown Realm magazine. Speak up, please. They'll kill me. Hmm? The village, Doolin, on the cliff of sea. Help me. Wait, wait. Hello? H hey, hello. see this kind of prank all the time, but somehow, this won't seem different. So, I headed to the village of Dulin, the realm of the dead. Is it you, Mother? I wanted so very much to see you. It was very hard without you. I was so young. But that doesn't matter anymore. Why won't you answer me? Excuse me. What? Are you the one who telephoned me? Huh? Who are you? Why would I? Hmm. Perhaps not. What about the lady over there? She's dead. We've got to call the police. Let me go! <gasps> Mother! 
father! Oh my god! Someone! Someone, please! Murder in the village of the dead. Tell me this is a joke. Ah, uh, that's neat. I kind of dig it so far. Alright, I looked into it. Apparently, you play the game through both, like, sides. And it's best to start off with her and just switch between the two as you go on. So I'll do that. Cool. My mother fell from the cliff. I need to hurry to the beach. Yeah. Use your any maps and mini map top. Okay. Cool. I like games where I can spin. This is already looking good so far. Alright, Mom. I'm coming. You shouldn't have gotten yourself killed again. I just got here. And I guess that was to be expected. That was neat. It's like a comic book. I whip my hair back and forth. Oh. Huh. I can save here. Alright, this is neat so far. So, I'm in the village of the dead, and my mom fell off a cliff, I think. And she wouldn't talk to me. And I thought she was dead for the longest time. So now I gotta go to a pub. Are you a- you don't look like a pub. You're hairy, it's all. Alright, hold on. Let me head to the pub. It's probably around here somewhere. This is Dr. Lester's home, of course. I can tell from the stethoscope that there wasn't.
Alright, this is cool. I found like a ghost bar. Hey, ghost bar patrons. It's like a giant dude with a little mouse friend. There's the bartender. I don't think he wants to talk to me. The mini map's in the way, and so are the things. Oh god. You look great. <laughs> this is really neat so far. Oh my. You're an angel. I never dreamed a girl so young would believe that the legend of Zero... Wait, what? I never dreamed a girl so young would believe the legend would come here. The girl of his dreams finally walked into Scarecrow's life. What is that supposed... This is Wizard of Oz. I'm Frizzy, the Banshee. A half-life who heralds death. You're off into the netherworld to look for your mother. That's sweet. Yeah. She fell off a cliff. So I assume she's there. I gotta go see this scarecrow you were talking about. Whoa. Okay, creepy scarecrow man, I'll follow this path south. I know exactly where I'm going because I have a compass on my mini map. Wish I had one of those in real life. Then I would know where I was going. Oh, you're right here. We here. Glad you made it. Shall we go see your mother? Take me to her. Oui. With pleasure. I have a soft spot for women in mourning. Today is special, as it's Sam Hine, or Hain. Probably Hain. It's a prayer day for the dead. You can go beneath the henge. Go there to get your clothes. What kind of clothes? Will I be able to see my mother then? Yeah. But you must perform the ancient ritual of donning the cloak of Sid Side. That's it. Apparently, the ancients were able to use that mantle to bring the souls of those in the netherworld into this world. Okay, I need to get clothes. Alright, cloak. Hook me up. I'm not paying for it. I'm only borrowing for free.
put on the cloak of sea, and you can meet the dead. The rest, Ellen, it's up to you. But be careful. Finding her might not be a good thing. Oh, help me. Hang on. Let me go. Hey, finish. <laughs> He'll suck the life out of you just to spite you. Lucky for me, I'm already half dead. <laughs> huh. I'll say this just one more time. The Netherworld's a very dangerous place. If you go there, you may never make it back. I must see my mother, if there is any chance of finding her. I can face any danger. Holy shit! I'm playing another one of those magical girl games! Yes! Damn, this is fancy shit here. Why, Ellen, you look to die for. Wee! <laughs> now, don't be afraid. Go through the door. You mean that thing shining there? Yes, that's the gateway between this world and the netherworld. Wee! <laughs> Damn, I look like I'm in a, a Korean MMO or something. It's weird. I really like it. All right, let's go then. What is this place? I feel like I'm in a dream. There's no time to sightsee. I'll be driven out of the netherworld at dawn. The question is, will you be able to find your mother by then? Wee hee hee. Oh yes, and beware of folks. They're made of the souls of the dead, and will attack. Well, you could have told me that sooner. That's a huge UI that's a little bit too big for my liking, but I guess I'll have to slowly adjust to it. Huh. Whatever. I I'll roll it for now. Oh, wait. You know what? Let me see. Nope. No options. Okay. Hello, other person. Hello, and welcome. This is the fairy realm, where we fairies live. On behalf of the Fairy Lord, we have long welcomed the living. Heed our advice well. What is your advice? Hello, and okay, I guess I'll go talk to them about your advice then, because obviously you don't feel like sharing. I have lots to tell you. I'll enclose important things in brackets when I talk. How the hell do you do that? That... Alright then. Living ones like yourself can use the portal in the square to return to the village. Oh. But today is Samhain. It's a special day. And you cannot use it. That sucks. The netherworld becomes more dangerous as you go deeper. When you're in trouble, just touch portal that radiates brilliant light. Your injuries will be healed. I don't know how that works. Use the power of the cloak to absorb folk ids. Then use folks whose ids you've absorbed. Not familiar with all the lingo. Someone will explain it. Because you're too busy to. The other day, I burned myself. Thought my id would pop out. 
When folks are exposed to the elements they're vulnerable to, like wind or thunder, there is Bok Dot. Try it if it's difficult to bash the heads out of them. I'm going to assume this is like some weird kind of nether realm Pokemon thing. Long, long ago, the living sometimes visited the netherworld, but not now. Why do people forget they could visit the land of the dead? Because they got iPhones and the internet. It's a lot of distractions. This indicates HP. Yep, typical idea with the HP thing. Uh, mine, yep, that's typical idea with the mana thing, just changing the boards around a little bit. Uh, assign folks to this pallet and activate them by pressing action buttons. The poke will continuously attack while you press it down rapidly. The kill mullis will act as a shield to protect you. Pokemon! Shield Pokemon! Alright, this is kind of neat. Hey, come here, little Pokemon. I'm gonna kick your ass. Poke battle. Poke, I'll choose you. Get over here. Valid attacks cause blue heads to fly out of faults. Okay, I hope this is valid because I see blue. If a red it appears, it can be absorbed. Press the absorb button, flick the controller upward. Oh god, I gotta flick it? Oh god. It is successively absorbed. Absorbing it increases the faults you can use and also contributes to character's growth. Weird. Oh god, there's more. Okay. Hacha. Alright. If red here, yep, you, you told me this already. I'm gonna kick this one's butt. I see red one. Stop telling me these words. I did it. Easy. Alright, so I'm already a professional at being a netherworld slayer. I'm here to kill the entire netherworld. Genocide run. There we go. No, oh, I, I saw you. There we go. And then over here, I'll wail on him, take his its, which I'm guessing is just... Well, it already said it was assault power stuff, but... I'm just making him be, do my bidding things. Good. Oh, there's more. Hey. Captured Folk's Karma has been released. Folk's possess many latent abilities that can be used when Karma is released. Um, view the conditions required to release Karma. Press the Star menu. Go to Folk's screen. Okay. This is different. I didn't have this menu before. Uh-huh. Uh, oh, I see. Okay. And Karma info. With the Karma of Folk's and the conditions necessary to release karma, karma releasing items are used here. Huh. Okay. So, I gotta, I, oh, okay, so I have to, right. I need to absorb those to get those things. And then for this one, I have to use pulse tree nuts. Right. 
But tell me about the system files. Okay. But about the system files. Cool. I can't make it not as big. But that's okay. Because I can reverse those. Because those are frustrating me. Alright, cool. What is going on, fellow? Hey, you, you got it. There you go. I'm just kicking Ed butt right now. I'm guessing this is going to be a common occurrence. Holy shit, there's so many of them. Good thing I got this cult thing. Well, maybe I just gotta walk through here. Who really knows? I sure don't. I don't wanna just leave them. I had to kick their butts and then use some tree nuts. Oh, get, get, get back here. Hey. So this whole time I'm gonna have to like, use actual hand movements instead of just fingers. This is like a freaking move game. I'm lazy. I don't feel like moving. God, it's like playing Wii Golfing, but just flicking your wrist instead of getting up. I did it. This is the land of the dead. It is known as the Netherworld in your legends. The Netherworld is the name your kind used to distinguish this world from your own. <laughs> the funny thing is, some of us even call it that. Oh, silly bellies. It, sorry. Today is the day of Sam Hay. It's a special day for the dead. On this day alone, the living can enter the netherworld. You aren't granted much time, so you must seek out the dead quickly. If whomever you seek died recently, they still they still may be around. That's good, because they really would be piss peeved off. I didn't want to say pissed, that's a bad word. If she wasn't. Anything you'd like to know? No. It's all pretty easy peasy, you know? Bye. Ellen, there's someone ahead. Hurry. I believe it's your mother. Hurry, Ellen. There's not much time. Damn these time restraints. Here I wanted to explore my linear path. What a nice guy. Mm -hmm. 